The veil is thin here. Can you feel it on your skin, tingling? I was trying to determine some way to show you what you mean to me. That's not necessary, Solas. You're my... That is the question, is it not? For now, the best gift I can offer is the truth. You are unique. In all Thedas, I never expected to find someone who could draw my attention from the Fade. You have become important to me. More important than I could have imagined. As you are to me. Then what I must tell you... The truth. Your face. The Valisleen. In my journeys in the Fade, I have seen things. I have discovered what those marks mean. They honor the Elven Gods. No. They are slave markings. Or at least they were in the time of ancient Alathan. My clan's keeper said they honored the gods. These are their symbols. Yes, that's right. A noble would mark his slaves to honor the god he worshipped. After Alathan fell, the Dalish forgot. So this is... what? Just one more thing the Dalish got wrong? I'm sorry. We try to preserve our culture. And this is what we keep? Relics of a time when we were no better than Tevinta. Don't say that. For all they got wrong, the Dalish did one thing right. They made you. I didn't tell you this to hurt you. If you like, I know a spell. I can remove the Valisleen. If what you're saying is true... It is. Then... My people vowed never to submit to slavery. I'm so sorry for causing you pain. It was selfish of me. I look at you and I see what you truly are. And you deserve better than what those cruel marks represent. Then cast your spell. Take the Valisleen away. Sit. Alasa Malarevas, you are free. You are so beautiful. And I am sorry. I distracted you from your duty. It will never happen again. Solus. Please, Vanan. Solus, don't leave me. Not now. I love you. You have a rare and marvelous spirit. In another world... Why not this one? I can't. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> 